Hey, guys. Honey, which of these cartoon characters reminds you of me? Don't say anything. Uh, Ziggy? What? Oh, my God! What the hell's happening here? Did you give him sugar? Excuse me, but I can't control what he brings home. Right. So have you gotten a good look at our new neighbors yet? No, are they out there now? No, just the movers. Wow. <laughs> so, these new people, what do you think we're dealing with here? I don't know. They'll never match up to Mrs. Fryman, though. Oh, I know, she was the perfect neighbor. Old, bedridden, no visitors ever came to see her. Well, that party's over. So, what is society the man we do? Should we go over there at some point and say hello? I don't know, I could send the wrong message. Yeah, we don't want to come off too friendly. Next thing you know, they'll be coming over here. Hi, can we borrow some butter? Don't worry. I'll set the right tone early on. I'll start them off with a nice friendly wave and then I'll, I'll slowly wean them down to a nod. Not a big friendly nod either, just like a, an up nod. Like, hey. <laughs> oh, here comes the couch. That'll tell us something. White. Leather. Yeah, it's nice. <laughs> a ship's steering wheel. All right, don't know what that's about. Oh, look, look at the little tiny bed. They must have a kid. That's a dog bed. Oh, they have a, a dog. Still barking. Doug, he's still barking. I know, that's why I had large fluffy things over my head. Yes, we hear you. God, this has been going on every night since they moved in. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Quiet. Shut up. Quiet. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Oh. Doug, what is their last name? Uh, I saw their front door. I think it said Saxky or Sackman. I know it had Sack in it because I remember laughing. Damn it, we've got some of their mail too. I wish I would have paid attention to the name instead of just throwing it away. Well, why do you want to know? Wait, because I was going to call them, but you know what? I'm just going to go over there. What? Carrie, you can't. It's one in the morning. You're going to wake them up. Oh, gee, Doug, well, I wouldn't want to wake the neighbors. All right, please don't go over there now. Why not? Because when you get mad like this, you charge at people like a crazed rhino. I do not. Trust me, you do. You don't realize it because you're all in there, but we're all out here, and believe me, we sense danger. It's not my fault. I swear, sometimes I feel like I'm the only one on Earth who's not an idiot. And you sometimes. Carrie, we're not talking about a waiter who brought you the wrong order, all right? These are our neighbors. We have to see them every day. I can't make it up to them by over-tipping. Okay, so how would you like to handle it? You want to just nod at them furiously? No. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, we'll go over there and we'll bring it up nicely, okay? <sighs> okay, fine. We'll okay. do your nice thing. Oi! You know, as, as long as we can't sleep, you want to take advantage of this and go to a diner? <laughs>